Hello, okay, today I'm going to show you how to use the tracking feature in DaVinci Resolve, specifically to get rid of tiny little blemishes like these. So this is Anthony, and Anthony decided to have a chest wax before his bodybuilding competition, and he broke out. So what we're going to do today is just try and fix that for the videos that we made him. So if you head on over to the colour tab, make a new node by pressing Alt S, and then make sure you're at the start of your clip. Okay, so then you would make a power window by clicking on this one, get the circle going, and then drag the circle over the blemishes in your footage or whatever you want to track. And then once you've done that, go to the tracker tab and press track forward. Okay, so that's almost perfect. Now it did go off a little bit towards the end. If we have a look, fine, fine. Where did it start? Ah, there, it caught onto the dumbbell. So when it comes back over, just make sure you click on the frame and adjust it frame by frame to make sure it stays where you want. Okay, and then just check it again to make sure everything's okay with the tracking. Okay, I'm just gonna do a few more adjustments. Okay, so for me, that looks perfectly fine. Now, if all you wanted to know was how to use the tracking feature, then there you go. If you want to learn a bit more about getting rid of the blemishes or how I do it, I'm sure there's different ways of doing it and there's probably better ways, but this is a quick way of doing it when you have a lot of footage and you don't have a lot of time. So now I'll just find a bit of the video that's clear and we can see all the blemishes. Let's go for this part. Okay, and I'm going to zoom in with the mouse wheel, drag it down. Now, there are a couple of ways you could do this. You could just come on to the mid detail, get rid of it like that. But like I said, that just looks weird. So the way I do it is by highlighting with the color picker, the colors of the spots. So if you just select one of them with the picker, go to the plus and just select as many of the different shades of the blemishes that you can find. Okay, so now that I've got that, I would click this highlight in the corner so I can see what is highlighted. What is highlighted? What has been highlighted? There we go. Now again, obviously that's way too much, so you just fiddle around with your controls here. So, now here all I'm aiming for is the purple spots basically. I'm trying to get rid of as much as the other bits as I can. Okay, I'm gonna say that that's okay for now. Then bring up the denoise, play with the clean blacks and clean whites, and pump up the blur radius a little bit. Now you do all that because when you're playing the footage, it's gonna fuzz about a bit. But if you denoise it enough, you won't be able to tell when it's actually playing. Because trust me, you can tell when people don't do it. I've seen a lot of student films where they've done that and in the shadows you can just see blue jumping around and it's really obvious. We can come back and clean up later. I just want to try and get rid of the spots first. Okay, so now we'll go back to the mid detail, pump it down. And already you can see a little bit of a difference. If we just do a before and after. Like I said, it's not amazing, but it definitely takes away the attention from the spots. Now let's see if there's any spots that we're noticing that aren't getting touched on. Now there's a few up here, so we'll see if we can grab these ones. Again, just keep playing around until you're happy with your selection. Okay, now let's have another look. Oh yeah, that's a lot better. So before, after, before, after. Since the blemished areas are a little bit different to his skin color, we can also try and play around with the color settings. So if we zoom in, where are the blemished areas? So they're a bit more purpley red. So let's add a tiny bit of green in there. Yeah, I think that blends in much nicer. Okay, so let's have a look at how it looks from the start.
Yeah. Okay, so that's one way of getting rid of blemishes. Again, it's not absolutely perfect, but it definitely takes your attention away from these to this. Okay, thank you for watching.